In order to create domain like this, we have to create virtual host using XAMPP server. This will help us to make project that looks like professional. Make sure that you had installed XAMPP server in your PC. Go to start and find notepad. Right click and run this as administrator. Once notepad opened, go to file, open. And go to C drive. Zamp. Apache. Confi folder. Extra. When you reach here and not see anything, you have to change this to all files. And then click on this httpd-vhosts.confi file. Copy this and paste below. Let's delete these two lines because we don't need them at this moment. And also remove this line. Then uncomment these lines by removing this comment signs on these lines. We will change this document root path and the server name. To find our project path, we need to go where Lara Blog project installed inside C drive. Zamp. Htdocs directory. Now, we need to open this Lara Blog folder and open public folder of this project. Then copy this path. Then change this path to our project path. Don't forget to change this backslashes to four slashed on this path. For server name, you will choose any domain you want. For me, I choose larablog.lcl for server name. Then save this file. Go to start again and find notepad. And also open this as administrator. Once notepad opened, go to file, open, and go C drive, windows, system 32, drivers, etc. If you reach here and not see anything here, you will need to change this to all files. Then click on this hosts file. Add the following line here. Make sure that this domain is the same as the server name. Then save the file. So, we can close this notepads. Our project still navigated by using this IP address. Let's close Laravel server by hit Ctrl plus C. If we refresh this welcome page. We are unable to access our project via this IP address. Also, if we try to access the domain we created under virtual host of XAMPP, this will not work. So, the first thing you have to do, is to open XAMPP control panel.
Then start Apache and MySQL. Let's test. Remove this S from HTTP then hit enter key on UPC. As you can see, we can access Laravel welcome page through this domain we had created. Next video, we will see how you can set up .env file and database in Laravel.